Hello YouTube, this is Step Ahead with Ernie Rivera. I am your host, Ernie Rivera. And let's talk about something for a minute, shall we? How to deal with failure. Failure, man, failure happens to all of us. And and here's, here's the problem, here's the main problem with failure. A lot of people think it's the opposite of success and it's not, it is its closest, closest friend. Uh, I'd like to talk to you uh, for a minute about a few things. A little bit about my experiences and why I think it failure is such a close friend to success well I I grew up and I was an actor you you all know at this point I was um, I was an actor and when you go into these auditions you know you you go into uh, one audition two audition a dozen auditions and you're likely to fail and it's not because you're not great it's because there are so many people you know, the, the market is so saturated, what are you going to do? But it's not just about acting. I mean, that is my personal experience, but, but it's about baseball. You know, you start off at baseball as a little kid, you know, you're, let's be, let's be honest, you're, you're probably horrible. You know, you, you, uh, you suck. And I, I personally wrestled when I was growing up. Uh, and I was the world's worst wrestler, you know, but I did stick with it. And um, in time, I I started becoming better and better. Uh, for me, my key to success, I only wrestled the very best people we had on the team, you know. I, um, I mean, sometimes I would train uh, younger guys, but, but at the end of the day, I would only wrestle with the very best best the team had to offer and what did that mean that meant I would fail a lot I would basically fail every single time <clears throat> and was failure so bad no I don't think so I'm gonna tell you right now why failure is is the best friend to success you um you will fail and some of you will stop and it's because it doesn't feel good to fail but the fact is if you ever want to get better you know how they say um how practice makes perfect well in practice you fail again and again and again and again and that's just that's just the nature of the thing you know you have to love what you're doing you have to really know what why you're doing it um this goes back to my last video um you know know your know your why why well, I, I don't know if it was my last video but it was close to my last video um but yeah you have to know your why because that's gonna keep you going you know you have to get into something that you love that you want to do and you have to fail again and again and again and again. And you have to become best friends with failure. Why do I say that? Because, because at the end of the day, you have to make sure that you have to make sure that you are comfortable with it. You are comfortable around it. At this time, I would like you to please smash the like button. I would like you to click like and subscribe and please hit that notification bell so that you get the first messages whenever we have a new video out. So um, we've talked a little bit about failure. Who is the prototypical failure? I'll tell you who. The uh, genius billionaire playboy philanthropist Tony Stark. I want you to relook at those Iron Man movies and I'll tell you why. Every single one of his suits sucked. And don't, don't get me wrong, I think we would all kill for an Iron Man suit. I mean, I, I would. Uh, that's, that's a pretty cool suit. But the fact is, they show you in every single one of the movies how his suits failed. For example, when Thor struck him with lightning and it, uh, it, uh, overpowered, his, um, it overpowered his power banks, uh, they show examples of how he improved the suit in the next movie. And that's every single one of the movies. Every single one of the movies, his suits came up short and he adapted. He adapted for the next time, for the next round. Tony Stark, the prototypical failure. That's what we should all be doing. We should all be trying to 
Not fail for failure's sake, but we sh when we do fail, we should fail up. Always fail up. I really do thank you guys for watching here today. Um, I love making these videos. I love talking to you. I know that at this YouTube channel, I might fail for a minute. But I hope to fail up. I hope to fail better. And I, uh, I hope to get the greener pastures. So I thank you. I love you. You're the best. Like and subscribe. Take care, guys. Bye.